Hi everybody, I am back. I'm here, but still not here. <laughs> I got a, I went out to the yard and I shot a little video, and, but I'm going to try to get back into it here now. I had those health issues, and kind of getting those straightened back up. But a little, went out there and shot a little video of what was a garden is not a garden anymore. So, and a few potatoes that was left from last year, they're still growing. I'm going to leave them in, let them, just let them do what they do. And try to get back to making some videos. Try to get some tomato plants or something out here soon. And see what happens. And before anybody asks me about Mr. Mo, Mr. Mo, I lost Mr. Mo back in the winter, so. I'm not going to go too deep into that, because he was my best friend. So anyway, I'm going to put that little video up. Then I'll, I got a picture of one flower that I've got so far this year. I'm going to put it up, and probably a picture of Mr. Moe there at the end. All right then. This is what happens when you get sick. Then you're gone for a couple of months. Then you come back home. No garden. Pete has no garden. Look, look at the weeds in the raised beds. <laughs> if I'm lucky, I'll get me a few to put tomato plants out this year. Yep. And a few of the potatoes that I couldn't dig last year were still in the ground. They're coming up. I'm going to leave them in there. See what they do. But the weeds are going to have them, I do believe. But they say potatoes, second year potatoes are kind of sweet. I'm going to check and see. Just going to let them go. Okay. That I had out there in the yard. There's my best friend, Mr. Moe, which I lost over the winter. Well, there it was. Wasn't that a poor excuse for a garden? <laughs> Oh boy, I turned my air conditioner off. It interfered with that first part of the video here, so I'm hoping this part won't be too bad. So, anyway, trying to get back at it. I want to say thank you for watching, and we will see you next time.